Welcome guys to another episode on the night Race 07. We're at uh, Road America, going all out American this time. We're driving the uh, Dodge Challenger STR8. It's uh, just a, just an 8 lap race and uh, this race I thought we'd start at the back of the grid, see how far we can get up through the field. So uh, it's dry so let's see how we go. So we're on the standing start, we're waiting for the lights to go. Got the rev set. And got an okay start. Going three wide in the first corner. So we're taking quite a few positions there. Going around the outside of the Cadillac we make it just it just gives us enough room. further up through the field. See if we can go now on the inside. I know we just lose front end grip. Now it's a drag race. We nearly get taken out there by a, a blue uh, camera. Now on the left side this red one. Who breaks first? I break really early. We still managed to get up on the left hand side again, on the up and the inside, and we managed to take that position as well. Let's see if we can go past the KW Dodge Challenger. He's swinging around the outside, he's managed to keep it there, but now he's got the inside of this, of this right hander. And he pushed, oh, that was close. We, nearly, uh, we did actually go off the track there, but could have been much worse. So, following in and into the left hander. Now we've got this nice long right hand which is so hard to keep the front end grip and the speed as well. You've got to kind of drift the back end, feather your throttle to get round really fast. That's what I find. Lose some ground there. So we need to push through this fast section. Crazy speeds. Red Cadillac behind him really breaks late. He's weaving around all over the place trying to keep the car under control. Coming towards the end of that now. Over that nice just little ridge. It's long, fast, it's quite a fast sweeping right hand. It doesn't look like it, but actually you can keep quite a lot of speed through there. Now we're just over the hill and we've done the first lap. These guys in front are all battling in front of each other which is causing them to slow down a little bit. Just hitting the, the rev limiter at the end there, but straight. But that's alright, doesn't cost us too much time. Trying to keep the car under control and the braking. Because these cars are so slidy. Any strong inputs will push the car out. So we're just going under the bridge now. We've caught quite a lot to the uh, car in front. Let's see if we can make a lunge down on the inside. Mm. Oh, he's, he's actually hit the, uh, the Chevrolet in front. On just on his left hand side, but is it enough to get up on the inside? Yes it is, we're now on the left because he's, he's got hold up by the uh, Chevrolet. Now we're going to push him wide. There we go. We've got another position, so we're now up to uh, P9. Again easy on the braking. Don't want to lock up those front, front tyres. Ever the throttle slowly around this right hander. Getting a good exit. It's a long straight, so you want to keep the speed up. You can't go too wide on that corner, or else you're going to get straight into that barrier on the left there.
challenge is really close behind me. Filling my mirrors up, but I managed to get a good exit. Slow in, fast out. Just slightly losing the back end going over Humble Street. Kept it under control. Just keeping it nice and tidy. This is where we ideally like to just get the slipstream from the kind of front, but I think we're just a bit too far behind. Slowly, don't want to spin up the wheels. Oh, yeah, he's had a bad, that slow exit. That's given us the run on this straight. Which way we're going to go left on the right. Staying on the inside. We just touch slightly and we get the position. So now we're in P8. Join me back now on uh, lap 5. Now caught up to the uh, pack in front. Quite a few of them there, so hopefully we'll be able to overtake quite a lot of them. And the Cadillacs had a slow exit. I'm trying to overtake him on the right-hand side, oh, but he's just got a good speed against us. Now on the left, try and go down on the inside, breaking, breaking. We just slightly touch there. and get back into the river, keep it nice and tidy. That's how you get uh, fast lap times with these cars, because there's so, so much power going through the rear wheels. It's so easy to get the back end sliding out just like that. We're definitely drifting around this corner this time. Kicking that back end. Well, we've got the messy exit. these series of corners fast and the car behind has actually just hit the, the barrier behind us whether he's got damage or not he's actually pulling away quite a lot keeping that left hand in nice and tight where we need a good exit for this long straight. Get the speed up. Hitting the uh, rev limit quite early there, so we must have got a reasonable uh, exit out of that last corner. Again, slightly just sliding through the first right hander. Mate on the brakes, and we really caught up to that, that dodge there in front. Now, if we can pick up the slipstream, this is a good passing opportunity down into this left hander. We're going to go on the right hand side this time because he's covered us off. We're breaking, we've actually gone on the grass. Lost the grip. Ooh. Trying to recover. Put our foot down because we just just a little bit frustrated that I put the right two wheels on the grass there. So now we need to cover up all that ground again. Two 
cars in front were battling just then, so that's actually brought us a little bit closer. Just trying to use the power to get the car around this long right hander. It's not doing very well for our tyres in terms of grip, but it's only an 8 lap race, so. break late here which is what we've done we caught up quite a bit but we've got quite a slow exit and that Cadillac's right up behind us again using all the road through that, that left hander slightly up braked ourselves into the final corner which is not what we wanted because we needed a really good exit here to keep the speed up then we got uh, two laps left I think we're just within the uh, slipstream distance gaining slowly and we just hit the limiter car in front a bit unsteady on the braking zone we managed to keep hold of it just keeping it nice and easy any more mistakes. Right, let's see if we can overtake cleanly this time. We're determined to keep on the left hand side because that's the uh, which way the corner of the turn. We're still, we're still side by side. I'm just pushing that wide a little bit. Oh, he's just, he's giving us the place. So now we're up to P6. And that Cadillac right in front of us nearly lost control of it. Though he's on the outside of this long right hand, which is where you don't want to be. But he's managed to actually keep grip. It's just in front of us, but the next corner is a fast right-hander. Oh, and he just brushes the uh, barrier there. He keeps the position. So can we do a lunge down on the inside? No, we're going to keep behind him for the time being. Great exit out of that either. Looking that we can try and get him on the uh, start finish line using the slipstream, but he's had a bad exit through that left hander. Here we go. Using the slipstream down on the, uh, on the inside of the track, and we've got him. This is the last lap. But he's good on the brakes. And he keeps the position again. He's had a bad exit though, so we can go back on up on the inside of the next corner. And we run out wide, which means that he has to slow up and give the place. Quite a distance between us and the fourth place. You're running low on fuel. So, whether these guys in front make a small mistake or anything. Not sure we'll be able to catch up. We're really pushing him. We've actually gone wide, just slowing us up, and we have to defend. There's that Cadillac, which is actually on our right hand side now. We we'll just push him slightly wide just to keep the position. Just slowing us up even more, knowing that that pack in front just to get away.
this fast right-hander. Trying to keep the speed and there's actually been a crash. So amazingly, we've actually got another position. So we're really pushing to see if we can get that blue Cadillac just in front. But I don't think we can because he's come up to the last corner. Really trying to keep the power and grip. No. Nope. But I wasn't expecting that. Finish P4. Race is finished. You're in the points. That that last uh, crash just gave us that extra position. Shame that we couldn't just quite make the uh, podium from 21st on the grid to the to fourth place. I'm pretty happy with that. That was a good race. Loads of uh, overtaking, which was exciting. If you enjoyed the uh, the race, uh, leave a like, uh, subscribe if you're new, and see you next time.